memories for me to this very day. Uh, when I was a boy of eleven, still very weak and sickly and frail, my father, Theodore Roosevelt, the man for whom I named, uh, the greatest man I ever knew, he called me into his study. And for the first time in my lifetime, rather than calling me by the diminutive nickname by which I was known in the family to that date, T.D., he said, Theodore, you have the mind, but you have not the body. And without the aid of the body, the mind cannot go as far as it otherwise should. It is hard work and drudgery, but you must make your body. I said, Father, I shall. <coughs> and I set out to make my body with calisthenics. I lifted weights. I swam. I rode.